there has been interest in examining nonlinear effects in the system of rotating magnetic fields. Such effects have been observed in the device called Searle's generator or SEG, SEG, Searle effect generator, and SEG, and SEG consists of a series of three rings and rollers that go around those rings. All parts of SEG are based on the law of the squares. The rollers revolve around the plates that form the rings, but they do not touch them. There's a primary north and south pole on the rollers and a primary north and south pole on the plates. Obviously you will have the north pole of the roller attracted to the south pole of the plate. The plate and the rollers have layered structure. The external layer, titan, then iron, nylon and last internal layer was made from neodymium. John R. R. Searle has supposed that the electrons are given off from the central element, which is neodymium, and they travel out through other elements. If nylon had not been put there, the seg would act like a laser and one pulse would go out and it would stop, build up, and another pulse would go out. But, with the nylon being, nylon acts as a control gate, and that control gate gives you an even flow of electrons throughout the seg. It was shown that in the process of magnetization of the plate and rollers, the combination of constant and variable magnetic fields for creating a special wave, sine wave, pattern on a plate surface and roller surface was used. The basic effects are the rollers self-running around a ring plate and reduction of weight up to occurrence of propulsion and flying up of all magnetic system. These effects come about because of a special geometry of experimental setup. It was shown that the work of the device in critical regime is accompanied by biological and real physical phenomena. Unfortunately except for the listed references we could not find other information where similar effects are be mentioned.